Hi, my name is Brendan, and you're watching Hello, VSPN. Howdy, everybody. Welcome back to another VSPN. As contradictory as it may sound, I hope you're having a good Monday. Contradictory is an understatement. At least it's October, though, so that's fun. Spooky season, man. Do you have any plans for Halloween? Oh, you know, probably just eat Halloween candy, you know, get thick or something. Nice, nice. Now all we need is someone to wear a costume to school, like the pilot costume last year. He had the leather aviator cap and everything. Yeah. Over the weekend, Valley View Marching Corps competed at the Southeastern Washington Calcutta Bands, competing against 21 bands, making it to the final round and placing eighth overall. Here we have an interview with RJ about the band experience. How did your section as a whole um, prepare for today? Well, there's a lot of training involved. You have to know that um, we've got our section leaders, our highest playing, and they're mainly in the control of our section. And they schedule sectionals where we take time out of our school days and after schools to uh, work together and for the, to be able to perform better. So, so make sure to tell any of your band friends that they did great out there. Good job, boys. Football played CUNA last night in a battle of the top offenses in the state. Although CUNA won 34-28, to it was a hard-fought battle throughout the entire game with Valley View fighting till the end. Land Larison led the rushing game with 148 yards and two touchdowns, while Carson Child chipped in with 79 yards and one touchdown. Sophomore Casey Cope also had 23 yards with one touchdown. If you're interested in the Boise National College Fair, sign-up forms can be picked up in the counseling office. Fill them out, turn in the top half to the tennis office no later than the 28th, and hold on to the bottom half to turn in at the college fair. In other news, the library is holding a pumpkin painting contest. You can get any size pumpkin, real or fake, and decorate the pumpkin any way you want, but make sure there's no carving. Points are determined by the quality and effort you put into it. The due date is Monday, October 28th by the end of the school day. Judging will take place the following day and the results will be announced that Wednesday morning. As for prizes, they will be given to the following categories, historical, modern, unique, and colorful. Well, that's a wrap up today's news, folks. Have an excellent rest of your day and stay tuned as always. And remember that Titanic's 108th anniversary is coming up in April. <laughs>